uh, I've, no, I've now opened up the Express and Echo and I find on page two the um, story about the bus stop is there. It was, it was on the website, Devon Live West website, last week, but it's now in the, in the Express and Echo. Anita Merritt, uh, that's all, all one word at reachplc.com if you want to contact, or else at Devon Live News, I guess that's on Twitter. And uh, there's a new photograph there, and it's updated slightly because... Um, since the video was shot, Disgruntled of Heavetry put up a handwritten post sharing his thoughts. It says, Well done, Stagecoach. A timetable display for those hitherto neglected folk, people over seven feet tall with 20-20 vision, and us shorter ones with binoculars. Whoopee. So that I, I've, I managed to remain a bit calmer in my, my video, which is what got Devon Live's attention. They've, they have mentioned that I've put it on YouTube, but they've got their own version of it on their on their site. Um, what is this doing on a drama show? You may wonder. Well, I'm I'm interested in drama as a way of raising different topics. So student accommodation. I've I've done lots of drama around that because other other ways of raising things didn't work very well. So I'm thinking about all sorts of different topics, some of them local, how they might fit together. Uh, I think dig digital is going to come into it. Um, but anyway, I'll, I'll, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to come back to different topics during the show because I, I haven't really worked out what I think about ver various things. So um, it, may, it may all get uh, sorted out coherently during this show or it might continue into the wild show because it's it's... It's um, it's not a resolved situation. Um, for example, social media will will come into it. I didn't get just on tweets when I launched the video. Um, I didn't get much response, but I'll come back to that later on. Obviously, Devon Live do get do get more more response. So there is a statement from Stagecoach, and the last paragraph because they they've got a new system for doing posters for timetables and it's, they've got the best of intentions with it um, but the final paragraph is as, as with any new project we continue to review outputs and welcome customer feedback to ensure the final product offers the highest quality information to the communities we serve so they may uh, revise their software come up with a, di a different design because um, I can see if you've got if you've got four routes at one stop, then this design might make sense, though it could still be lower down where more, more people could see it. Um, but if you've only got one, you could put it right at the bottom or you could do it in bigger type because it's, it's actually surrounded by white space, which is about three times as much space as the information that they're trying to present. So I, I can see this all being sorted out at some point in the future. Um, but also I can see it uh, turning into a story. I think I'm going to play some more music and come back to um, the story so far continued because um, when, I, when, when I explained this all on the, on the Wild Show last week, there was, there was developments from, from that. So uh, I think I'm going back to the play up system and some, some Green Day, which... Uh, Chris Norton might, might like if you're, if you're listening, Chris, or we could play it again later on. <laughs> 